the biggest question arises in your mind when you are going to get yourself admitted in medical college yes what is the admission procedure when i was a kid definitely i also wanted to become a doctor and the one and only question arises in my mind at that point of time was that how to get myself admitted in a medical college so definitely if you are knowing each and everything about the admission procedure then definitely this particular journey gives you a lot of encouragement and lot of happiness as well because one and only thing which encourages you always that is information my dear yes a perfect information a perfect criteria and the perfect procedure for getting yourself admitted in the medical college is the most important thing in your life my dear so this particular video is going to be an amazing life changing opportunity for you where i am going to explain you that how to get admission in mbbs in government medical college yes welcome to test prep card channel my dear and this is your mentor over here who definitely research a lot things about medical colleges and all and explain you in a better way so that you well define yourself and make a good plan in your mind so that definitely the journey of your medical science the journey of your doctor become pleasantly happen all the way right so myself this is my dear all this particular video is going to be amazing my dear so please 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 do not stop this particular video for a second watch this video till the end and one more thing which i am going to tell you is that the bar will give you a particular subscription notification so go and subscribe this particular channel and share this particular video as much as you can right because your one sharing will give you our uh, give you us an encouragement my dear all the video creators over here in test prep card will definitely encourage right when you share and when you like this particular videos because your one like and your one share will definitely encourages us a lot and gives us one uh, panacea gives us one zeal to at least research a lot of things about your queries so let's get started without any wasting time my dear so how how to get admission in mbbs in government medical college bachelor of medicine and bachelor of surgery and commonly known as mbbs is a dream for every candidate who wishes to make his or her career as a doctor nowadays people are not respecting god but people are respecting doctors my dear yes doctors are the second god in this particular earth and this particular job is not a job this is a service which you serves whole life my dear and definitely this dream comes true only when candidate qualify the national eligibility come entrance test that is neat the one and only criteria which allows you to get yourself admitted in this particular medical college which is qualifying neat examination you do not have to worry about the postpone of or your postponement of your examination you have to prepare yourself well you have to prepare yourself well for each and every aspect of life you have to focus on each and every aspect of things you have to have you have to add all the information what you definitely require so definitely if i talk about the process of admission in mbbs in government medical college involves a centralized counseling process which is conducted by the directory directorate general of health science that is gh dghs right and conducted elsewhere right on behalf of the medical counseling committee mcc so admission 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 definitely this particular word gives you a rejoicing moment right because without getting yourself admitted you cannot start your career you cannot start your journey you cannot start your beautiful journey my dear right so my dear all this particular the score obtained by a candidate in neat 2021 will be used for admission to 15% of all india quota first of all all india quota aiq and 85% for state quota mbbs right means suppose that there is a seat of 100 students in uh, west bengal then definitely 85% of seats will be given to the state students who have applied for this particular examination and 15% students of 50 in in 15% seats all india uh, quota will uh, comes under this particular criteria 
So 15% of intake of all seats from every government college will reserve for All India Quota. Whereas remaining seat will be available for admission of candidates who fulfill the required eligibility criteria for 85% state quota seat. Eligible uh, candidates. Yes, one more detail is that. Suppose that in 85% quota, if the seat is vacant, then definitely it is carry forwarded to the next level as well. Right. It is according to the state and according to the prescribed medical college as well. So you no need to worry about that or you do not have to think about that as well. Right. So how to apply for MBBS admission in government college? This is the most important question when you are finding any college and all. So the first step, I will tell you each and everything step by step. So don't have to worry about it. Right? Just closely sit to your mobile in front of your mobile or your laptop and please listen to me word to word. Right. So the first step to get I am reading each and everything over here just for you right I have made a particular detailed information over here I didn't learn each and everything right but yes I am explaining it to you properly because I grab all those information over here and I have separated all the information which is definitely beneficial for you if you are going to visit a particular website then definitely it will confuse you a lot but over here in this particular video you will get each and every information which is definitely relevant uh, for your query, right? So, the very first step to get yourself uh, admitted in MBBS in Government Medical College, it is to appear in the single undergraduate level medical entrance exam that is NEET 2021 or 2022 or 23, whatever in which year you want to apply, right? For this candidate, hard to fill NEET application form. And you have to be very curious about NEET application form release. As soon as this particular form release, you have to fill this particular form. And get yourself enrolled first, right? NEET 2021 will carry 180 multiple choice question. 180 multiple choice question from chemistry, physics, biology. NTA will declare NEET result in the first week of June. Suppose that the exam happened in May, then definitely will get the result in the first week of June 2021. And the candidate who secured the category wise minimum qualification percentile will eligible for the admission to MBBS in medical college in India. Then, then what will happen my dear? So admission in MBBS in government medical college under 15% all India quota, those medical aspirants who clear need and get shortlisted under 15% uh, all India quota will have to register themselves for the process of counseling. Means after result, you will, uh, they will call you for the counseling. The schedule for need counseling will be released by the MCC means Medical uh, Council on its official website. So you have to regularly visit that particular official website as well. Means uh, before getting yourself admitted in a medical college, you have to be very curious. You have to be very curious about dates. You have to be very, very curious about result. You have to be very curious about the notifications. Means every notification is definitely very important for you, right? At that point of time. So the schedule you will get then link for the same will be provided above as per the directive of the uh, supreme court of india the allotment of seat for the need uh, that with that is 15 percent all india quota as i told you as well seat will be done in two or uh, two or rounds only right and uh, if i talk about the next thing that is after counseling what will happen so how to get admission in mbps college that is need counseling registration first in order to get admission, my dear, in government medical college, then definitely 15% quota scheme will be eligible. That is for eligible medical aspirant will be able to register themselves for seat allotment process. After they download need rank letter, they have to download the rank letter. Candidate will have to enter the below mentioned details as well. So like, what are the below the mentioned details? I would like to tell you, right? In this particular list, you will find a roll number, date of birth, email ID, candidate name, application number, mother's name, mobile number, and yes, security pin as displayed on the screen as well. And what is the site actually? mcc.nic.in, right? This is for new registration. Okay, move on to the next. Having completed the new registration process, candidate will receive a mail. You don't have to worry about, right? They are also encouraging you again and again or they are also entertaining you again and again you don't have to worry about that you will not get any kind of a mail or not or notification you will get using the login credential received 
कैंडिडेट विल हैव टू लॉग इन एंड एंटर द नीट यू जी डिटेल्स राइट वट स्कोर यू गेट राइट यू हैव टू एंटर ओवर दैर और आफ्टर एंटरिंग योर रजिस्ट्रेशन आई डी एंड ऑल ईच एंड एवरीथिंग विल बी केयर ओवर दैर बट येस ऑल इंडिया रैंक मार्क्स ऑप्टेन कैटेगरी कैटेगरी रैंक एंड अदर आस डिटेल्स ओवर दैर यू हैव टू फिल इच एंड एवरीथिंग द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज टू मेक एप्लीकेशन फी पेमेंट यूजिंग द अवेलेबल ऑप्शन मेडिकल एस्पिरेंट मस्ट फर्स्ट कंप्लीट द रजिस्ट्रेशन प्रोसेस एंड देन फिल द लॉक फिल एंड लॉक देयर चॉइसेस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू लॉक योर चॉइसेस राइट एंड यू हैव टू मेक मेनी चॉइसेस इज वेल अकॉर्डिंग टू योर यू कैन से सुविधा राइट अकॉर्डिंग टू योर फैसिलिटी और यू कैन से अकॉर्डिंग टू योर रिलैक्सेशन राइट ओके इफ आई टॉक अबाउट ऑल इंडिया राइट देन प्रेफर द कॉलेज एज वेल एज कोर्स सबमिटेड सीट एवेबिलिटी रिजर्वेशन क्राइटेरिया इच एंड एवरीथिंग विल बी केयर ओवर दैट ओके then the next one is admission in the mbbs in uh, government medical colleges under 85% of quota that is aforementioned part from 15% all india quota seat the remaining 85% seat are covered under the state quota and government college of uh, every state in granted if i talk about candidate who is domicile of the particular state for admission in the government medical college yes definitely without domicile definitely how can i decide that yes you are from this particular state and all so beside the below mentioned detail of standardized eligibility condition aspirant have to fill the domicile qualification requirement as the stated by the state counseling committee as well so basic eligibility criteria for mbbs admission and all so these are the particular below mentioned details my dear age limit qualification examination percentile domicile minimum qualification percentile each and everything you have to mention okay suppose that need cut up percentile if i talk about then definitely uh, you will get a separate video on this particular topic as well that what is the cut up criteria and all right over here i am just going to give you a just brief detail about this particular thing that it uh, divide into four category my dear general sc st obc uh sc sc obc as well a uh, general ph as well and uh, sc sc obc ph if i talk about general then 50 percentile 720 to 147 and general ph that is 45 and 146 uh, to 129 uh, you can say cut off a score if i talk about sc sc obc then when you 40 percentile 146 to 113 uh, that is the cut off a score if i talk about sc sc obc ph then 40 percent and 128 to 1 One one three, right? So thanks for watching this all of this particular video, my dear NIS. Please, please, please comment over here if you get yourself admitted, right? And please share this particular video and please uh, press the subscribe button. Bye bye. Thank you and thank you.